Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're new to this channel, my name is Amra and this is Amra's Beauty Blog. I'm a freelance makeup artist with a passion for all things beauty. If you're a subscriber, then a welcome return. If you like this video, then please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell for weekly uploads. So, today I'm going to be demonstrating Natasha Denona's I Need a Rouge Lip Stiletto. Now I have two of her recent launches. She did two colours which were in Gigi and that's the liner and the lip and then I also have Amelia which is in the liner and the lip. So I thought since I've just done a review on her Love Face palette I would demonstrate her lip products. So, so let's start off with the colour GG and this is how it looks so it comes in a very cool container and then you have a lip pencil to match so what I thought I'd do is use the lip pencil put the lipstick on straight after so I'm going to line the lips with the pencil and then we're going to try the lip so Gigi has been described as a ribbon red and Amelia is a true crimson so this is Gigi and this is a lip pencil for Gigi. So this is Gigi and it's a really lovely red that's kind of got a bit of orange to it actually. And the pigment is amazing. It didn't take me long to get this colour to appear. So here is the swatch of Gigi and the lip liner swatch. So the next colour we're going to look at is Emilia and let's take a look. So this is Emilia. This is the liner for Emilia. Wow, I'm just so surprised by how pigmented this is. It feels really comfortable on the lips, just so you know, and it has a kind of matte finish. I don't think this is a sort of satin finish, but it doesn't feel too drying. It's a gorgeous shade. So this is Amelia. So this is the lip and hand swatch for Emilia. So those are the two new Natasha Denona I Need a Rouge lipsticks. And actually I'm really impressed. I was really not sure what to expect because I've bought some of her other lipsticks before and I felt like at times those lipsticks, the formula wasn't just quite right for what I normally like for my lipsticks. I enjoyed the colour variation because she did I need a nude and I like that but with these reds they're really really lovely actually I don't think you're going to be disappointed if you picked up any of these for now I think this is really really nice I'll leave a comment as to how they perform in terms of having to reapply through the day but I do think that the colour selection in terms of the two reds, they're really different and really nice. So that's my final thoughts. Please let me know your comments. Have you picked up these? Are you thinking of picking them up? Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell and I'll see you in my next video. Thank you.